going on everybody track fan AJP here just need to touch in with you guys post fight about GSP Condit a few weeks ago I made a pre fight video but I'm just finally getting around to a post fight video so here it is uh, I'm gonna make it short and sweet I uh, don't got a lot of time but uh, yeah what a fight man I mean Condit proved he deserved to be there I mean almost had George out in that third round um, George definitely had the edge in the stand-up because besides that head kick, I think George um, landed the majority of the punches, the majority of the strikes standing up. Um, on the ground, gosh, I'd almost call it even because they were both so active. Carlos never stopped throwing elbows and punches, hammer fists from his back. George never stopped throwing punches or elbows from top. Um, Damage-wise, well, gosh, I mean, George got that big cut open on Condit's face, so that played a big role, and that was real early in the fight, so I think that was very important um, for George, you know, in terms of the way judges saw it and all that stuff, but at the end of the fight, you could see, man, both of their faces were tore up, um, you know, so yeah, I mean, I would, I mean, George had, you know, ground control on the ground, but, I mean, Condit was maybe even a little more active than George was off of his back, um, you know, but standing up, uh, I think George landed more shots, but Carlos came closer to finishing that fight. I don't think Carlos was rocked at any point during the fight. Um, he got outfought, you know, um, but I think, I think Carlos came closest to getting a fight stoppage. You know, a couple more shots after that kick in that third round, he might have been able to seal the deal, but ultimately George was able to scramble enough to, uh, you know, regain his composure and ultimately regain top control on the ground. He reversed it and, uh, you know, resumed where he left off before that kick. So, um, yeah, man, it was an amazing fight. Carlos, um, you know, he showed, he showed why he deserved to be there. I mean, the guy is never out of a fight. That's what's most dangerous about Carlos Condit is the guy is in it from bell to bell. And I mean, if you relax or if you lose focus for one second against that guy, he's going to jump all over it. <clears throat> all over you and make you pay for it, you know? If you leave that window open, sliver, man, he's gonna crawl in and he's gonna kill you, you know? I mean, that's the type of fighter he is, you know? He, yeah, there's no room for error against that guy. And, uh, you know, you saw it in the George fight, man. Uh, you know, he almost put George away. He came closer than uh, the majority of people who have ever fought George uh, to getting a stoppage, you know? So that just speaks volumes about the guy's ability. And, um, you know, not to mention, I mean, what fucking heart? Are you kidding me, man? The guy didn't look like he was phased at any point during that fight. You know, all the blood, all the elbows, it didn't it didn't matter. You know, he was going to be there. Fuck, they could have gone 10 rounds, and he probably would have still been there in the 10th round wanting more. You know, the guy's just a dog. So, Carlos Condit has big things to look forward to in the future, you know, and, uh, you know, he's the sky's the limit for that guy. And same for George, you know. I mean, I could see both of them actually fighting again uh, in the near future, you know. Kind of gets a few more wins, and I could see them having a rematch. So, I was very pleased with the fight.